Okay, to find the mass that is placed on top of this vernier collision cart, we should realize that each cart starts out with a mass of 500 grams before we place any of the masses on top. Right now, both carts are at rest, and there is a compressed spring that will be triggered to send these cars in different directions. Okay, the key idea with momentum problems is that the total momentum before the interaction equals the total momentum after the interaction. Since both cars start at rest, there is no momentum to start with. After the collision, one car will move to the right, one car will move to the left. So although it looks like we are adding two numbers together, the one moving to the left will have a negative velocity and therefore these two must be equal but in opposite directions. So when we trigger the cars by hitting the plunger on top of the car, we know the mass and velocity of this car so we can find the momentum. We know the velocity of this car so we can work it out and solve for the mass. Once we got the mass, we subtract the 500 of the car, and that will leave us with the mass that is placed on top of the car.